I can't lift it up. I can't lift it up. <laughs> you hold it here? I'll hold it here. scrap metalling. Used to do this to make pocket money. Used to be worth quite a lot of money, scrap metal. Up to like $200 a tonne. It's not worth anywhere near that anymore. So jump in my ute and uh, just drive around the streets. And people leave washing machines out, dishwashers, barbecues, that sort of thing, fridges. Hey, here we go, here's a fridge now. junk out and um, people like me go and look through it for the metal. Have a look, here's one now. Anyway, so here's, here's my junk pile at home. It's pretty small now, I can tell you. There's actually not that much there at all. A couple of years ago, there was a time I had 10 ton of steel. I'll start loading it up and what I do is I pull out anything that's extra value out of stuff so for example transformers out of microwaves or cut the leads off or maybe a motor out of the a motor out of a washing machine that sort of thing okay time to load up front loading washing machine to value add what you want to do is you want to cut off any leads because something like that is worth two dollars a kilo and I want to get that motor out dollars there's the transformer transformers are worth three dollars because they've got a lot of copper inside and copper's far more valuable than iron this is stainless steel and the way that I can tell oh it's not stainless steel it's magnetic Stainless steel isn't magnetic. This hand railing, it's not magnetic. It's shiny, I can tell it's quite heavy. I can tell that it's stainless steel and stainless steel's worth a bit extra. All old microwaves from dissections at school. Now, this is, um, this is, from, a, this is from a combustion fire chimney. Uh, and it's scrap metal but it's probably only worth about 10 cents and I think it could be good for another project so there's some things I keep you know this could be good for maybe an outdoor fire heater or something like that oh, now, oh. old car batteries have got quite a lot of lead in them and lead's fairly valuable so you can scrap car batteries se separate they're also a non-ferrous item and they're, they're worth I don't know, maybe about four dollars each or something like that. I can't believe I used to enjoy this. Anyone want a barbecue? Sinks are stainless steel, they're not magnetic. To get the best price though, You gotta get rid of any junk. So now, pure stainless steel. My favorite things when people throw out extension leads. I mean, this is probably worth about, oh, 10, oh, about 15 bucks. So, thank you very much. Another thing that's worth okay money is from air conditioning units, the cooling coils, the cooling and the heating coils, because they contain a lot of copper 
and aluminium, but you have to separate them out, so it is a fair bit of work. But that's called valuating. Look at all that copper. Woo! Okay, tied down, covered up, ready to roll. Let's go to the scrap metal yard. To the scrap metal yard. Oh well, I've uh, dumped every, I've dumped off all the metal, and they've weighed the leads um, about 17 kilos. They've weighed the stainless steel 41 kilos. You know all those transformers I pulled out of the microwave, which I said they've got copper in them. Well, apparently now the um, companies don't use copper; they use aluminium, and so the stupid things were worthless. So all that effort of pulling out the uh, microwave transformers, waste of time. Not very happy about it, but them's the brakes and it's one reason why I'm getting out of scrap metal. Now, it was absolute chaos in there again. Um, trucks everywhere. I felt bad like not asking permission to film, so that's why the, you know, that's why the footage was like uh, pretty dodgy. Oh, well, that's it for my uh, scrap metal days. Scrap metal days are over. Um, that motor, I got 48 cents a kilo, so wow, $3. Um, the insulated wire is $2 a kilo, so for all that um, electrical wire I got $34. The lead acid batteries have got $0.60 cents a kilo, there was 55 kilos and so um, $33, that's not bad, batteries are alright. The iron, <laughs> the iron I got um, $16.86, so all those, you know, the washing machine and microwave oven bits and pieces. The stainless steel um, is 90 cents a kilo and I had 41 kilos and so I got $36.90. Um, there's a waste, dispo waste disposal charge of uh, $10 and so all up I got $113.75. Well, I guess it's enough to take my wife out for dinner. Thanks for joining me today, and that's how we make science fun. <laughs> See you later.